Indian Army has been continuing relentless operations in the past three months as part of Op Trinetra. As part of the same, on 16th July, an uh, input was received about movement of unidentified persons in the general area of Sindra Surankot. Accordingly, the area was cordoned. On 17th July, specific intelligence regarding persons' presence of armed terrorists near villages Sindra of Surankot again of District Punch was received. Based on this specific intelligence, an operation was launched by Indian Army along with Special Operation Group of Jammu Kashmir Police. The coordinate search of this area was carried out. After establishing an effective cordon, the troops commenced their search of village Sindra. Four terrorists who had taken shelter in the forest near the village opened indiscriminate fire. Their fire was promptly retaliated and the terrorists were pinned down in the general area. The cordon was then readjusted to deny them space to escape. Special forces were also inducted to augment this operation. The terrorists, making use of terrain, forest foliage and inclement weather, kept opening fire onto our troops in a desperate attempt to break the cordon. In a display of excellent junior leadership, coordination between Indian Army, Jammu Kashmir Police, own troops displayed superior tactical equipment in retaliating to the terrorist fire while pinning them down in this general area. The intermittent fire between the terrorists and own troops continued till about 5.30 in the morning. However, the troops in the cordon were at their highest alert to prevent the terrorists from escaping. In the morning, a detailed search was carried out. The search resulted in the recovery of large quantities of arms, ammunition comprising of four AK series rifles with eight magazines and 196 rounds. Two 9mm pistols with three magazines and 24 rounds were also recovered. The bodies of four neutralized terrorists were also found in the area. I wish to bring out that these weapons which were found with the terrorists had Chinese markings on the AKs and the pistol had Pakistani markings. The presence of such heavily armed terrorists in the hinterland is an indicative of attempts to destabilize the region and if not neutralized in time, these terrorists would have carried out major terrorist initiated incidents in the coming days. This joint action by Indian Army and Jammu Kashmir Police has resulted in saving the lives in the coming days. The relentless operations by the security forces will be continued and it is being seen that they've started giving results. The Indian Army along with Jammu Kashmir Police and other sister agencies will continue their operations with renewed vigor to flush out the remaining terrorists operating in the area. The recent contacts on the LC, if we see what has happened in Sarla and Noshara sector, allude to the bigger plan of the Pakistan of spreading instability in the region. The operation is a hallmark of cooperation between all intelligence agencies, especially the police, with the Indian Army who were spearing, spearheading this operation. I again would be doing injustice if I do not mention the cooperation which we received from Awan in this endeavor which speaks volumes of their belief in our nation. Jahin, now I hand you over to SSP Punch, Mr. Vinay, for his comments, please. Oh, thank you so much, sir. <coughs> Jahin, uh, we were receiving a lot of inputs uh, in the recent times and uh, in uh, an action with for some uh, specific input, we launched an operation in the general area, Shindra. Uh, as Sir has just briefed you, uh, we have been able 
the joint forces led by army uh, plus police uh, and CRP of 38 battalion. Uh, we launched the joint operation and it has resulted in the elimination of four hardcore terrorists uh, and the recoveries uh, as the formation has been de uh, de uh, shared with you include four AK-47 uh, pistols and a uh, lot of other things. So this particular operation is an indication of uh, top level synergy amongst all the security forces including intelligences and uh, I can assure that uh, we are quite sure about the fact that uh, it shall continue in the future also.